Sub game. Hey, what's up, gamers? <laughs> okay, so I'm doing this video today for uh, Saltex. He wanted to have a guide to play uh, League of Legends. Uh, he, he wanted me to do a guide for not team fight, but for the real game. I don't play the game anymore. It's been like years that I did not play the real mode, but I will still maybe try to help him with that and if it can help you if you never play and you want to play maybe these tricks will help you help you a little so if you go in collection here you can see that there is some runes and these runes will be set that you can use on your champion they will boost slightly your st the stat of your champion during the game so it can it's like not that much but it will slightly change like helps you so there is like a more damage, more support, more da um, magic damage, and magic damage is ability power in this game, and damage is uh, physical damage is um, attack damage, AD, AD and AP basically. Uh, tank, so you have armor, you have magic resist, armor resists the physical damage, and magic resist reduces the magic damage. Uh, you have health of course, you have mana, so every time you cast a spell you will you will consume mana and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. I will not do a real game, I don't want to play it to be honest, but and still, I mean that would just be long for nothing. Uh, I will do a uh, custom, oh can I, oh you know what, let's do a co-op versus AI, oh no. I don't want to play with other players, I just want to do a... Okay, I will create custom and I will do... Yeah, okay, let's do that. Let's do a custom blind pick, all team size 4, 5, I mean... Team size 1, similar rift, 1 Rion, okay. I will keep the 5 because I don't, I want to... To have the real map. Um, there we go. And I will add here a robot. Okay, Shivana, start game. So this is not a real mode. Uh, this is a real map, but not. I mean, I will be alone. And yeah, so I will be middle. I will just take a character just to show you. Let's go Lux. And there we go. You can choose your your room set. I will take sorcery. It's the one pre-made, these are pre-made, and these are the ones that I made. You can make your, your home. And here you will have summoner spell. When you start, you will have only a ghost and heal. Ghost increase your uh, your movement speed for a certain two seconds, and heal will give you health like at the moment you cast it. And you will also uh, run faster for one second. And But after that, you will get half the, the heal for a couple seconds. Or more than just a couple seconds, but like maybe five seconds. I don't know. I will not pick that. I will go with uh, flash and ignite. But when you start, you will be level one, so you won't have uh, you won't have access to these summoner spell. So these summoner spell, if I'm not wrong, they will be on the key K and S. Uh, me, I put them on D and F, but it's yourself. You can do what you want. And yeah. So after that you will load, you will see uh, your, the people in the game here, you will know what you fight and you can change what you want at this point, I mean change. You can decide like, okay maybe I should swap lane or something if you fight something that is your, the, the something you're not good against, but yeah. What I like to do here, it's quick cast, okay? So when you press it, it will instantly cast toward the current mouse location. And I would recommend you to practice using the quit cast all. Like put everything on quit cast and if you really want you can not make make it normal. When you make it normal, you have to click to you have to press the button, then you will have the 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 distance showing and then you will be able after to just uh, to click to shoot the spell. So I recommend to do quick cast all and the rest is up to you. And there, when you click on this shop here, you will have items, you have money, and you get money over time and when you kill minion and uh, champion. 
okay? So your goal is after you will go in a lane. And here I will be mid because... Oh, I think the robot will go bottom though. Yeah, okay, I will go bottom. At 1 minute 30, minion will start to spam. 1 minute 20, I think. So when you will start, you will have pretty much... Oh, yeah, 1 minute 10 after all. 15 maybe, but they are already spam. So these little minions will fight against each other and then when you will help them to defeat the others. Okay, where is Shivana? Yeah, she's there, okay. So the, the goal here is to hit the last hit on the minion, okay? This is not Dota, you don't have to vanish your own minion. But when you can see here, when this this almost dead, I click on it to kill him. I missed the, the other one, but yeah, so I would just do that here just to show you. Okay, this one is about to die, I click on it, and I get 14 gold. I click on him, I get 14 gold. So you have to learn to do that, which is the thing I hate about this mode. I really hate doing this, okay? This is the reason why I'm not playing this. I just want to fight other people, I don't want to fight minion. It's just, it's a strategy, I mean, this is the strategy part, like, you have to fight me and at the same time fight the, the champion. Okay, right now Shivana is, I try to click on the minion, but I click on her, but yeah. Okay, now I can just, okay, I missed her though. When I, I have Lux, okay, you have different type of champion, you will have uh, assassin, tank, a support, a damage dealer, bruiser, that's pretty much that. So here, wow, I'm so bad. Lux, when I hit someone with a spell, there is a light on him after. And the light, okay. I, if I would have snare, snare her right now, she would have been like... She would have get a lot of damage because the goal is here is to push your minion to the other turret, to the tower. And then you have to destroy the, to the tower. And the ultimate goal is destroy all the tower until you reach the nexus, and then, yeah. So here, I can poke her as long as I stay outside of the circle. Like, I can shoot on her, I won't be target from the turret. You can see that. But if I go inside the turret and I shoot her, the turret now starts shooting at me. Even if the minions are there. Now she's going right, like, a little... Uh, but other than that, and if you go out, the turret will now go back to a minion. So as long as you don't... Okay, seriously. I would just poke her a little just to be annoying here. But yeah. Because she's a robot, I would probably win on her. If I don't, I'm pretty bad. I would just poke her with my... Seriously? That much? I keep my bubble until she go out of it because, okay, I, I will hit her as well. There you go. So she should die. Yeah, she died. Um, I will just farm this and then I will recall. But right now, it's like I, it's a robot. Okay, it's nothing really crazy here. I'm just showing how to basically play. Okay, I, I'm using my mana because I don't care, I just want to go back. Uh, I'm just killing these the fastest I can. And when they reach... The goal here is, by pushing this way, the turret will kill the, my minion. And this way, these minions won't give gold to the Shivana. So this is the plan here. The, the longest she can't have the minion, she won't have XP from them. But now she's close enough, but yeah. So when you kill people, you get gold, more gold, 300 gold the first time, and etc. I will buy this one because it gives magic penetration. So you magic penetration just go uh, will penetrate magic resistance. So character has magic resistance, the magic resistance will be lower. So as you can see here, you take 24 reduced magic damage with my magic resistance, but her, like, for example, if she had 24 uh, reduction, well, my manic magic penetration from this will do more than 24, a little more. So again, it's a robot, so I would just poke her slowly. Uh, like, normally she could just jump on me and stuff, and, but, and sp spare, like, in a more, in, in a most interesting way. 
but yeah. Okay, I will now I'm going back because the minion weren't targeting me. So now they are not. I can use my bubble to farm them. I will do that here. Boom. Because like I said when I hit seriously. Now she's dead, okay? I have my ultimate. Uh, will it be enough? You know what? I will wait the, f the 3 seconds of my snare. What? Oh, crap. <laughs> wow. I get all play on this one. Damn. That was bad for me. Uh, I, I don't have enough mana for the ultimate. I would just poke her to get to keep it. That was really bad for me. I was not expecting her to come back on me. Which was not a really bad thing, but will she come back if I do that? I don't have enough mana to do my two attack though. I need 180 I think. 50 mana? Okay, 150 to do my Q and my ultimate after. So my ultimate look like that. I will do it because and I, I will go back to my base after. And uh, yeah, so it's a really long ultimate. It's Lux. You can see here, it can go up to all the circle that you see on the mini map. So it, a light will appear, and after a moment, it will just shoot a big laser to all of it. Mm, yeah, okay, I will buy this. This uh, increases the ability power, the blasting wind plus 40 ability power. So here we have, I have 75 uh, magic ability power. If you go on your spell, you will see 205 plus 53. The plus 53 is from my magic power, my ability power. So basically, this spell gives 75% of your AP bonus to your damage to your spell damage to this one. And then it increased by 25% your your barrier and like 30 something 40 40 something percent for my bubble. So my AP just boosts all of my spell. Lux has a pretty fast ultimate, especially when you level 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 it up. You get your ultimate at level 6 and then you will get your second level to your ultimate at level 11 if I'm not wrong and then I think it's 16. Now I went like super mode but okay, okay. She can transform though. You can see the, the big like, okay she did not transform but she could cast her ultimate. Now I will push again, so my goal is just to kill the minion enough, but yeah, a real game is not as easy as I'm doing right now. Uh, I enjoy playing this one way more than the real one. I don't like, I mean, there is a lot of champions that I just don't know what they do as well, so I could go back, but I will stay. I will get more XP, more damage to the turret a little, but yeah. So you have to be careful of not entering the turret when you hit the champion as I showed you before. And uh, you have to farm, like I said, you have to do the last hit on the minion to get the 14 gold, 21 gold and 80 gold from certain. So right now I'm focusing mostly on my Q because it's doing more damage than the others. The E will be a better idea if you have to do a lot of AoE damage. What are you doing? Okay. Ah, it was not enough, but look at that. You see that? I knew that she were still in this lane and I shoot my laser to kill her. So yeah, the ultimate. But Yeah, it's a robot again. A real person would have tried to, like, knowing it's fighting Lux and my ultimate, like, might be ready. They would have just go like, hey, I need to go. <laughs> I need to not stay in this lane. 
This one is more AP. And when you mix them together, you, you will get... Uh... Okay, items can be fused together, alright? And you can see, like, right away. You, normally, you click on the one you want to reach at the end. So this one, for example, you want it. You click here and you will see all the, the one you need before you reach it. But these are final items, like... After that, you cannot fuse it with any others. Your limit is 6 items. You have ward, uh, when you press 4. You can put ward and basically it will show, uh, yeah, it's important to do. So you sure that you're not being gank. So being gank is people trying to kill you. Uh, other people going on your lane when you don't expect it. And uh, yeah, so I, I'm harassing her right now. She's pretty stupid. She's low health and she's staying there. I did all my spell on her, but it was not needed, okay? I'm waiting them to all enter and then hook. Like I said, with locks, you have to wait a little to be sure, like, I, I, if you can, if you just do a spare, like not a big burst, you can just shoot one spell and then do an, a basic attack so it consumes the light. Then you can do another spell, or you can cast the bubble in advance, and after that you consume the light, you then activate your bubble again, and you will do a second light, and then you can do another... Uh, if you can do that, it's more you, it's more uh, efficient. But if you have to kill someone fast, just you can spam everything. Like, if you know that it will kill. But that's why I'm just doing this, I poke her, I send my bubble and I poke her again. So you see the damage? It's just, it's a little more damage in the end. But this is for Lux, okay? Not, I, I don't know, you ask me a uh, guide, but. Yeah. I did uh, again all my spell on her. I like to consume the bubble after my attacks. But. Also because the bubble, the bubble of Lux will slow enemy. So basically, if there is a enemy like running after me, I can do that, and just they will get slow. And when they reach the the circle border, I click back. So at least I do damage at the same time, and I will have slow them down during the process. Lux is is a really good unit. She's one of my favorite. That would be even better if we if you could just. Um, wait, 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 wait. So what should I build with that? You can click on the item and see what you can build with these. You can, I will do that, okay? I will build the Ramadan, what is the, is that a Ramadan cap? Rabadan dead cap. It increased the ability power by 150, but also the passive increased ability power by 50, 40%. So your flat ability power will be increased by a percentage as well. So it's really the, like the pure damage from mage this is the best item for the pure damage um, yeah it's not a thing it's not a support or tanky item okay i have everything i would just kill her at this point i have inyard as well inyard put your target in fire and so I did everything as you can see, I ignited her and just everything. I know that I had the damage to kill her. Right now I'm just harassing her, but she, this is a robot, okay? It just, it just easy. Okay, so when you use your minion to push like the, to push and you keep behind her, them to get, um, to get to the turret and then destroy the turret. I will destroy the first one now. And it will be destroyed on this one. You cannot cast spell on them, but some spell can indeed do more damage. But the spell that will do more damage is spell that increase your home damage by on physical attack. Some of them. So some character can be faster to kill turret. There is some character that will also be what we call a lane, not lane posture, but... Okay, I'm just getting rid of her, I just want to clear it the faster I can at this point. 
Uh, I want to show you the, the the goal of the game. I don't know. I mean, there is a lot of stuff that I can forget, but yeah. Uh, if they are, if if you are ganking someone, if you are like attacking someone with other people, what you should do is waiting for the tank to attack the character under the turret first. So the turret will aim the the champion. As you see, if there is minion targeted, and you You cannot enter the enemy base by this place, but in your home base you can pass through this wall here. So this is a one-way wall. There is character that can jump over like fence and stuff, so you have to keep that in mind as well. There is a lot of stuff, okay? It's a really basic thing here. The Calis of Harmony is really nice because the more mana you, you lose, the, more, the faster your mana will regain. But yeah, if you watch... Oh, what did I just do? Okay, you can do undo, so you don't lose any money for the last item that you bought. Now, I click on this one and I look at this. This one gives even, even more magic penetration, so that will be the next one. Uh, again, I'm doing a pure damage right now build. It's not like there is no support on that. When you click, you can see that it's choosing a auto path for you. If you don't like it, you can just change your like click on a different way i want to pass with this lane so i just change it you can hold your mouse to make your character just like follow your mouse when you hold the right click um i don't know i it's not a big tips but he wanted me to give you a quick beginner guide but yeah that's pretty much it for the guide i will destroy the nexus just to complete it and i think that will be it uh, there is a time here, there is a number of CS you do. If you press tab, you can sh see the, the stat of the other player. Watch in the top, there is 9 versus 0. I have 9 killed, she has 0 kill in, their, in her team. So you can see like, oh, should I be careful? Are, are we winning or not? Like, should I just keep behind my turret? Or, yeah. Okay. But now that I have the Kindness of Harmony, I'm not afraid to use my spell. Okay, so the second turret has been destroyed, so I cannot. I'm not afraid of her at all. Like there is no turret that can 
Oh yeah, there is a laser here. If I enter, never enter this circle, okay? I will show you. It kill you in two seconds, okay? So execute. Uh, you can see I received 2000 damage from the turret. Was it a good idea? No, because my minion don't seem to be able to handle to finish the fight. And yeah, so the item here is costing me 1.3k to fuse it. And I have the two items and I will still need... Well, I, I could finish this one. But yeah, my minion made it. So my minion destroyed the Nexus. They changed the animation as well. And then victory. And when you finish the fight, you can click continue. And you will see the stats. So you will see how well you've done your KDA. Kill, death, rate, um, assist. So... Uh, I get 9 kill, I died one time, as you saw at the end, the items I have, so you can, if you get home by someone, you can maybe try to look at his item if you want to learn, but yeah, there is a lot of stuff to learn in this game, you have to learn every champion what they do, Shivana that I was fighting can transform into a dragon with her ultimate, dragon will increase our, our tankiness, armor, magic resist and health, and she also change her spell so she will do like breath of fire instead of just shooting one fireball she will have a fire around her that do damage over time she's a tank she's a tank damage i mean not really damage dealer but she's a bruiser uh in league of legend in tft she's really strong she's in TFT, they took only a part of the spell of every character. So most of the time, they take just a small spell. Sometimes it's their ultimate, and sometimes they also take another spell. Like, for example, um, Nidali. Nidali can heal. The heal will heal, but normally she heal with her he, if I'm not wrong, the, the third spell. And she transform with her ultimate so they combine the heal and the ultimate into one skill in tft but yeah it's just different thing so these days as you guys have seen i'm playing tft but when i'm not playing tft when i play play league i will play aram so you don't have to choose your unit you can just pick whatever you want i mean not whatever you want what the hell <laughs> you will have a champion given to you and you can reroll it uh, Trista, twisted tree line is a tree versus tree. This is two lane. Uh, it's not tree line. It's two lane. There is a jungle in the middle. Summoner, Summoner's wrist is the one that I just did. There is also Dominion. Wait, Dominion is not there anymore. They removed Dominion, but. I'm not surprised Dominion was not really played that much. Uh, maybe it's still somewhere, but maybe you can create a custom on Dominion. But I don't see it. Okay. So I won't explain Dominion for nothing. It seems to not exist anymore. Uh, so yeah, that's it. Okay, so I hope that you are uh, answer your questions, Halt. If you have any questions, just comment. Just comment and I will answer. You know that I read all the comments. As long as I'm not a big YouTuber, I can read all the comments. <laughs> and I don't think I will become a big YouTuber, or at least not these days, but yeah. Okay, so thank you for watching, and I wish you all a good one. Sub game.